Happy Vlogmas day three. I just got done finishing watching Vlogmas's days one through three from the last, oh my God, like five years. Holy moly, life has changed. So yeah, we went from, <laughs> we've gone from no dogs to Charlotte to Baxter. And then we had Buddy last year and oh yeah, yeah, the house has changed so much. So just kind of reminiscing there. Hey, I was booked from 10 a.m. until 7 p.m. at the salon. It's currently at 12.20, clearly I'm not at the salon. Um, my whole day has fallen apart. <laughs> so my first one, which was going to be a color extension move up, cut and um, like style, which usually takes me three to four hours. She moved to Thursday, which fine, whatever, I just go in later. Then I had somebody else, they canceled. Then my next one was like a lash and haircut. Well, she already, she got her haircut over the weekend. So uh, she canceled half of that appointment. Fine, whatever. Haircuts are 45 minutes, that's not, not a huge deal. Then my next one was a color and cut canceled because she spent too much money over the weekend from like Cyber Monday and Black Friday and like all those deals, so that's really great. So I'm left with one lash fill at 2.45 and then I have a, um, consultation for microblading because I won't microblade anybody unless if I have a console at 615. So this morning I had my receptionist call my 615 to see if she could come up even at like 530 um, because that would be so much, it would be like less of a gap. And I still haven't heard from her and it's 1220. Um, so I just texted my 245. I was like, hey, just wondering if you could come any later. If not, it's totally cool, but figured it didn't hurt to ask. Um, she asked what time. I was like, I, honestly, I could take you as late as four, but any later would help because I have that huge gap and I'm waiting to hear back from her. So just this is a PSA. If you have a, an appointment with your hairstylist and you schedule the week after Thanksgiving, you cannot cancel because you don't have money. That is absurd. So because all of those people canceled, I think I've lost out on $500 today. So yeah, it's fine, I'm fine, I know it's part of the business, but just keep that in mind when you're canceling or rescheduling appointments. Like I don't make money now because everybody canceled <laughs> and it's kind of too late to reschedule people. But I've pretty much just been hanging out here, just been doing like boring, boring stuff like laundry and like tidying up around the house. So you really haven't missed much. So update on my life. Everybody but one person canceled. So I had my boss slash more so renter or landlord, I'm the renter, um, call to see if she could come a different day and she is. So I've had the day off. It just would have been nice to know in the beginning of the day. I did steak and veggies in the crock pot and then we gave the fat to the puppies and they loved it. Now I am just working on laundry and like house stuff. I don't know what else we'll get into tonight. So they say if you give a dog an egg, they'll cherish it and not break it. No, <laughs> not Baxter. He snapped, he smashed it. Sit, Baxter sit, sit, good boy. Oh, that was so gentle. <laughs> She's so excited. What, why are you so excited? Watch you going to do the egg challenge? Charlotte, come here. Come here. Charlotte. <laughs> come here. Oh, what are you doing?
she doesn't know what to do. <laughs> no, I don't want it. He's like, D this is my- Ew, Baxter! Uh, What's your oh. deal? Uh, uh, Hello, happy Vlogmas Day 7. I haven't vlogged the past few days because literally all I've been doing is working. And that's not very exciting to be like, hi, I'm on my way to work. Bye. I am not on my way to work. I'm going home. So, Vlogmas Day 7. I have some exciting stuff today. Currently on my way to my lash appointment. Well done, my lash appointment. I don't know if you can tell. Um, and we are going to head to the shelter next. It is their adoption event. So all dogs are $20 and then all cats and critters are $10. Yeah, go, go, Melon. So does it finish the story? So back at home now, obviously, um, I was able to walk only two puppers and then I came to the third one and she had a big cone to shame on so I didn't really know how to walk her. Um, so I just hung out in her kennel and then somebody wanted to meet her and I was really excited. So when I left and now it's like 1.15 and it takes me like 20 minutes to get home. So let's say around one, there was only three more dogs available for adoption and two of which were seniors. So I'm really hoping people put in, um, applications for them. One was the yellow lab, one Coco Melon. She's like a little mini pity. She, um... She just, she, well, not just, she gave birth to uh, puppies and um, it's just her left now. All of her babies have been adopted, but not her. And she's so cute. She was the one who was doing zoomies um, when I walked her. So pretty much I barely walked her. I just let her zoomies around. So she was super cute. Ellen, the lab, and then Lady Love, who I don't remember if I got video of or not. She, her story was, I know Charlotte, she was left alone, I think in a garage that uh, like the, her family abandoned the house and we don't know how long she was in there. Um, and then she obviously, somebody finally found her and um, she was brought to the shelter and you know, got was made healthy. And then I guess her like original family um, was like, oh no, we want her back. After they left her and abandoned her in a garage. So then that held up adoption again. And then finally, she's available, and I really hope she gets a nice home for the holidays because she deserves it after she was abandoned in a freaking garage. I hate people. So hopefully I get word that um, they're available. Like, they Give me a Big Mac. Super size my fries. Why you staring at me, bitch? Go get my apple pie. I need a Diet Coke to wash that all down. Hey guys, so I am just editing the video right now. Excuse my hair, but I'm looking over the footage and I just wanted to let you know that all but two dogs have pending applications and Lady Love, the pupper who was, well, she's not a pupper, she's senior pupper, but who was left in the garage has a pending application. So that's really exciting.